You were everything to me. And I miss you. That would be enough to win me right back. Yeah. Right? Even if I have no memories of you, you say shit like that to me? Howdy, folks. Welcome on back to you, me, and the movies. And guess what? Time to get our sci-fi adventure on with Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3. Okay. And before you ask, where's Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 1 and 2? We've already seen them, sorry. Yeah, we saw them years ago before we started our channel mm -hmm. in theaters. Were they in theater? I don't know. We've watched well, saw, them. We've, wa them we've watched theaters. them lots of times. Our, yeah, our, our, daughter, our daughter went through a big Guardians of the Galaxy phase. She was watching phase. Like, Volume 2, like... On repeat yeah. for like two months straight. Dancing to Baby Groot. Oh, yeah. It was Crazy. cute. It was a fun time. Yeah. But yeah, well, where did we leave off with? Do you remember where the Guardians of the Galaxies were last time we saw them? You know, I remember um, sending off the one guy. Yondu. Yondu. Yeah. In the fireworks. Yeah, and that I was at the end of Volume 2. That was But a then we one. also had Infinity War, which the Guardians. Oh. And Half of them died, right? Gamora. Gamora was sacrificed by Thanos. Yeah, got thrown off the cliff, right? And they did the whole time loop and got Gamora from the past. I don't remember that Who at hadn't all. met Star-Lord yet. Oh, I don't remember that at all. Oh, that sucks. And so... So now we're... They're not... It's like Groundhog's Day? She doesn't... She's not in love with Star-Lord because that never happened anymore. That fucking sucks. that Gamora is dead. Yeah, you know what? What was that movie called? End, Infinity End, War? Endgame? Infinity War and Endgame. I think those ruined they they ruined superhero movies for me. Yeah, it was just too too sad. It was just like cool. You killed everyone. Yeah. Well then Great. Well they brought them oh, back. Oh, don't worry. We'll just rewind the clock and bring them all back. Except no. For and they, then by that time I I'm I've lost interest. Like don't kill everybody. They didn't bring back And then bring them back mostly. They didn't bring back Iron Man. No, he he, he died. He sacrificed himself. Let's yeah. Let's not just kill people and then say, "Oh, just kidding." I mean, well, I, turn me off to to these kind of movies, and I honestly, I don't think we've watched one since. We watched Spider Man. No way home. Spider Man doesn't feel like the same. Yeah, I mean, he is in the MCU. Oh, no way home. With, oh, yeah. With all three Spider Mans, I could have done without it. Yeah, you don't like no way. Could have done without it. It was good. All right, well, we're starting this one off hot with hot takes. Hot takes. She doesn't like superhero movies but anymore. Then Thor. Joined the Guardians of the Galaxy to go on a little joyride at the very end. Because he, and, that, he okay. and Peter had that, you know, rivalry of who's actually the captain of the ship when Thor was on it. So I think we'll see Thor a little bit in this. Okay. Too many but moving yeah. pieces. But yeah. Guardians of the Galaxy are, I think, both of our favorite part of the MCU. They were. We'll see if they re are they able to recoup yeah. the, the gloriousness that the first two... Yeah. Well, James Gunn's back to finish his story his three volumes of his story his all right arc. well hopefully he doesn't mess it up too much or should we jump in and see how much he messes it up <laughs> yeah i guess so <laughs> let's do it but first like comment subscribe come hang out with us for guardians of the galaxy yeah i'm sure three. we'll love it <laughs> so i'm sorry i'm i'm feeling positive about it i just uh, she's feeling positive about it it's going to be great. Yeah. And check out our Patreon link down below if you want early access to our videos, if you want comedy access to polls, so people watch next. Links down here. Check it out. Let's watch Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3. Here we go. I can't be the only one that feels this way about superhero movies. If you're not here for genuine, honest takes, I don't know why else you'd be watching. I can't be the only one that feels this way about these, right? Like, did anyone else lose interest after no, Infinity people, Wars? There's a lot of people that feel the MCU has tanked since Infinity War. Like, that end game should have been the end. Well, I mean, I, or just don't kill everybody. Don't make a movie where everybody dies. <laughs> and then expect the, the crowd to keep on following. Well, that was only in the first half of that movie, though. They could have done Guardians of the Galaxy 3 without... I don't know. I wish they would have left Guardians of the Galaxy out of it. And at the time that it was happening, I was like, oh. All right, shut up. Watch the movie. All right. It's raccoons. It's fine. Not just any raccoons. One of the main characters is a raccoon. I am aware. Well, 
Jesus really built the anticipation there. Poor little rocket. Great song. Like an angel. Get an MP3 player now? Oh, yeah, it's Peter's Zoom that he got from. Oh, Yondu. the Zoom. <laughs> Where are they at? Um, this kind of looks like the. Almost like that prison they were in, but I guess not. Wow, look at Groot. He got. He bulked up, didn't he? Gains. He must work out. <laughs> Probably that fertilizer. Is he so he's controlling all of the music? So they run this now. I think this is nowhere from the first movie. It looks like an iPod, kind of. This is the this is the censored version of this song. Oh, he's an angry drunk, huh? Not a good look, bud. It's like Cosmo joined the team. Where's Gamora? Is that the same girl that played her sister? Yeah, it's Nebula. Well, I know it was the same actress. Yeah. Body build it looks different. Like her face looks different. Are you sure? Yeah, it's still Karen Gillian. The answer name. Hmm. Nowhere. Guardians of the Galaxy headquarters. Bunch of numbers and letters. So what are you gonna do about Quill? Me? Why not you? I got emotional. Mm, that's her voice. Why are you on the ceiling? I want to see if these new gravity boots worked on a slope. Kinda. Are you sure? Yes, it's her. She just looks different. She's just older. It's been like five years since the last Guardians movie. Or end mm. endgame. Oi. You must know you will never learn. You think you could do better? Nah. <laughs> Doug's got skills, huh? Telekinesis is cheating. That's a stupid little Telekinesis is cheating. You're a bad dog. Oh. Do not take that to me. You are. You're a bad dog. <laughs> Take that back. <laughs> he called me a bad dog and he refused to take it back. <laughs> Listen to me. Yeah, he has been pretty mopey ever since Gamora died. She's not dead. She just doesn't remember anything from the past few years. Mantis, why don't you just touch him and, you know, make him happy? I am Groot. Bro. <laughs> no. <laughs> not like that, Groot. <laughs> it is wrong to manipulate the feelings of friends. What the time you made me fall in love with my sock? Well, that was funny. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking heart. I've seen them in concert. They slay. They slay. Even as old chicks. Yeah. They're fucking awesome. What was that? Peter's old tape deck? What the hell? Who's this creep? Where did you go, squirrel? It's not squirrel, it's a raccoon. Hmm, who's this kid? On the ground! Ooh, nice arm mod. Ouch. Oh. So 
so he's like fucking Superman then? Uh oh. Groot's pretty powerful. This guy can beat him. Jeez, they were just getting this place looking nice. I know, he's making a huge fucking mess. So rude. <gasps> no! Not again! He's fine. He's not completely destroyed. He can regrow. Hey, Karumba! Damn it. <laughs> Who threw this thing at me? Shut up. Baby. He's one of the gold people from volume two. Don't remember any of them. Yowza. Apparently just bulletproof body too. Mm, let's go Drax. What do you do to Rocket? Don't know. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Great. That a girl. Jeez. Will he survive this? No! All I did was activate the med pack. Get them off! No! Jeez, oh, I didn't even see him shoot rocket. Oh, not a Groot spider. Find your body, buddy. He's not a spider, he's like a four-legged crab. Is that better? Oh, the guy left. Guess that wasn't a killing blow? Apparently not. We need to get him to the med bay! He was destroyed! There's one on the ship! Stitch him up and transfer him in with the rest of Batch 89. Mm -mm, he's gonna have some PTSD problems here. Oh, jeez. Does it work? It's okay, friend. Spider bunny. Don't let them scare you. I'm scared. No. It's okay. You're gonna be okay. Aww. Dang. Why would Rocket have a kill switch? Apparently someone considers him proprietary technology and sent that golden lunatic to get him. So he'll die if we operate on him? That golden guy came for Rocket. And there's a code on all of it. 89P13. He's got maybe 48 hours. Oh shit. Right? Maybe they'll have a way for us to override the kill switch and save Rocket. They won't just give us that information. Well, that's why we're gonna break in. And kill anyone who gets in our way. Not kill anyone. Kill a few people. Kill no people. Kill one guy, one stupid guy who no one loves. <laughs> <laughs> Take back what you said that I'm a bad dog. Nope. I know you don't really think I am a bad dog. Can you please take it back? I will not. Oh. How he's the same way. You need to tell him he's a good boy. <laughs> or he's going to be sad for a while. Yeah. Sure. Well, this is a new ship. Yeah, it's interesting. What happened to all of Rocket's old friends? Do you have it? He does not, sir. I tried to warn you, my evolutionary. These guardians are more powerful than you think. Or perhaps you simply overestimate your own. <laughs> a flaw of some type in my own design. I created you lot as merely an aesthetic experiment. Beautiful numbskulls. Oh, he created that whole 
that whole race, huh? Wow. Nothing wrong with me. I was stabbed, you extraordinary bastard. He doesn't know any better. We should do whatever you require, my dear. You knew of 89P13's existence. Ugh. He's got RoboCop face. So creepy looking. How did 89P13 survive after all these years, Teal? It was always clever, sire. Yes, that's exactly why I want it now. Of course. It's brain. That is the only reason, sire. That little sidekick there, it was in Superstore. Yeah. Ugh. That looks like a giant weird butthole. It's the Orgoscope. Orgoscope. It's bioformed. Instead of... <gasps> hey, he's your best friend. Second best friend. Everyone around me dies. <laughs> My mother, Yondu, Gamora. Gamora isn't dead. She is to us. You want a Zargna? <laughs> She's Drax. <laughs> People on Earth die when they're like 50. They die when they're 50? I don't know. Something like that. What's even the point of being born? Exactly. <laughs> Are you about to die? I'm not 50. <laughs> Drax is like nodding. Yeah. 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 He's about to die. And maybe I wanted a Zargna. It's too late. They're all gone. Uh-oh. It's not the shield. Oh, it's hell. the butthole. Oh, no. Stallone. Hey, guys. You're about to be boarded by the United Ravagers. You can surrender and turn over any stuff worth anything and live, or you can die. Toast up to you. Come on, Peter. Use your connections. These are all the original guards of the galaxy before the... Yeah. We have an appointment. We have an appointment. With who? With Gamora. With Gamora. What? You're early. Gamora's a She's Ravager? She's a Ravager now? She's like the leader of the Ravagers? <sighs> oh, no. You're gonna have to wear these to move through the Orgo without attracting attention. This isn't my color. Nothing's really your color, bud. Why would you not tell me that you've been in contact with Kamora? Because I didn't want you to get freaked out. Freaked out? Ow! Like that. <laughs> Uniform. Never pictured you as the Ravager type. Who are you again? Man. <laughs> so, they're heavily guarded by the deadly Orgo sentries. Ew. Gamora is going to lead you to the records. Or maybe you can find the pass key to override the kill switch. But if you get into trouble, we will not be able to bail you out. Sweet. I gonna get in trouble? Hopefully not. But probably. That's music. We like it. We do. He's gotten a lot uglier since then. Uh, the, yeah. More. Modified himself yeah. more. Take an imperfect clump of biological matter such as you and transform it into something perfect. I feel like he's doing experiments on all these creatures around the galaxy to make himself better after you find something successful, right? Mm -hmm. And that's why he looks so different now. Could be. I've developed a process by which I can guide any organism through millions of years of programmed evolutionary in a moment. You turn into a dinosaur? It's a turtle. <laughs> oh boy. Teenage mutant into turtle now. There's the rub. For some reason, we... they get aggressive. Well, violent. We don't like it. The utopia can't have its denizens murdering one another, can it? It can't. 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 <laughs> they suppress the lighting, the glycosylated salts, is. and then boop, 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 half cysteine residual will be forming. And then they make, um, what do you say? The Ligo beta microsamina proteins. Yeah, thems. And then angry turtles. Is. <laughs> He's so smart. And then he perfected the next batch. 
That was when he made the... Got a bunch of Ninja Turtles rolling around? I wonder when he made the Sovereign. Ooh, look at them. So colorful. It's like a bag of Skittles. Taste the rainbow. Why is Mantis, like, flipping her out through the air? <laughs> like, controlled chaos? Yeah, it's kind of her style, isn't it? Oh, but that smells great. It heals itself too quickly. So you really don't remember anything? Like what? About your time with us? No. You and me? That person was some alternate future version of me. Wasn't me. Then why are you... Why are you fighting it? You were everything to me. And I miss you. That would be enough to win me right back. Yeah. Right? Even if I have no memories of you. You say shit like that to me? Well, what I'm trying to say is... Peter, you know this is an open line, right? What? We're listening to everything you're saying. And it is... Painful. And you're just telling me now? <laughs> we were hoping it would stop on its own. <laughs> blue was the open line for everyone. Orange is for blue. What? Black is for orange. Yellow is for green. Green is for red. And <laughs> Yellow. Green is for red. Red is for green. I don't think so. Try it then. Hello! <laughs> <laughs> you were right. How the hell am I supposed to know all of that? Seems intuitive. What? <laughs> It's the opposite of intuitive. They should have all been color coded, and then black should have been the open line, right? <laughs> yeah, obviously. It's a great meat hole. Did that Charlie's Theron? I didn't get a good glimpse. Oh. Ride the acceleration to crush your spine. It's got that brand new Fuselix core. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, yeah. Is this in the Firefly universe? Master Karja. Must be. Not sure, at least there. Not sure, so. He's too fat. Not fat, just large. Ooh. Ow. Yowch. There's some sort of anomaly in the decompression chamber. Best you check it out, Master. On it. Do they have little meat suits like that? I don't know, but Nathan Fillion, he... He's hot. He's looking good. Even in that weird suit. What the hell was that, guys? <laughs> what procedure, bro? Oh, you want us to read the manual for you too, bro? Exactly, you idiots. <laughs> I'm angry too. <laughs> Excuse my friend, he he's the boss's nephew. He's a little Oh. oh. Yeah, I I got one of those too. <laughs> this one I just <laughs> Everything he does drives me crazy. I thought you said something else. Shut up. <laughs> How'd you guys get here so fast? I'll be honest with you, we just happened in. Oh, Oopsie. no. See. How are they going to get out of there now? Not oh. the way they came Sounds in. like a garbage shoot. Damn it, Mantis! Why don't you ever think? Are we pretending to be angry again? Mantis, you asshole! <laughs> <laughs> we'll find another way out of here right now. We need to save Rocket's life. That's future use problem. <laughs> Bug and Doofus, access the spaceport through the elevator so Tree can land and get us out of here. Bug and Doofus. <laughs> See you. You're hopelessly in love with him. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing today? I'm all right. Drax the Destroyer. Oh, that is such a lovely name. 
I'll be here when you come back out, okay? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Bleedle Snort. How long is he going to be in love with Drax? Forever. I'll handle this one. How? Pure Star-Lord charm. I'm excited for you that you get to see this again for the first time. Oh, boy. It's a little out of practice. Uda. Hi. Hi. My name's Patrick Swayze. <laughs> and the way that you smile to yourself when you think nobody is looking, it makes my every day a bit brighter. We need your hand. What are you doing? She was never going to fall for that. Ah, she was totally into me, man. I kind of thought you were a douchebag. Oh, come on. <laughs> Wait, 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 wait! Sounds like a species tag. Show us! Jeez. Gamora is really violent. She was really violent. She, this is to still kind of a bad guy. Yeah. Gamora. Only good Nebula is the one that turned her. Mm hmm. Whoever it was that you were in love with, it wasn't me. It sounds more like her. Her? What? That's ridiculous. Do not bring me into <laughs> place to lie down. I didn't say anything. <laughs> I just never noticed how black your eyes were. They were replaced by my father as a method of torture. <laughs> <laughs> you picked a pretty set. Is Peter falling for Nebula now? That'd be weird to me. I don't think that's a good sound. No, that would be a bad sound. Run! Fight! Run! Fight! Take <laughs> I got a plan. What is it? All of you, come with me! Everybody! Lower your weapons or I blow this woman's brain out! That's the plan! Cool doesn't have a weapon. <laughs> Violent rage. <laughs> Let's kill that one that looks like a carrot to show we mean business. God, Pascamore is just mean. She was always like that, and yet I was the bad guy. We are not killing anyone! <laughs> he thought he was gonna get shot. This close. What an ugly dude. Why are you being so mean? Carrot. We used to be in love. Yeah, she was my girlfriend, only she doesn't remember it because it wasn't her. That girl died. And then came back a total dick. You left out some important information, but that is the gist of it. <laughs> Set phasers to stun. Everybody down on the floor, always blow your brains out. Hey, 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 we don't want any. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on! No, please stop doing that! <laughs> this is Groot's f flying song? Apparently. Oh. Oh no. Where's one of those heel patches? I think Drax is a little bit more durable than that. I don't know. Uh-oh. We need to get out of here with this to save my best friend's life. Oda, please. Does she have a heart? Tell them your truth. Yeah, I'm not that big of an idiot. I just needed to get into the system. He knew he can get through her to her. She was in the main. Yeah. <laughs> Made it. Like a glove. That looked cool. <laughs> <laughs> if it's enough to save Rocket. Probably that thing is actually the key the to meatball. fixing him. I have been thinking. About what? Since you guys are my closest friends, you might be interested in knowing that I have been. 
thinking. That's cool. <laughs> <laughs> I would like my name to be Lila. I think my name shall be Teeths. Because although we all do have them, mine are definitely the most prominent. <laughs> Teeths. <laughs> Me be called Floor because me is lying on floor. Brilliant. Someday, I'm gonna make great machines that fly. And me and my friends are gonna go flying together. Lila, and Teeths, and Floor, and me. Rocket. Good names. Why did he never tell us about any of this? This is worse than the one that I was did to me. Is it though? They almost turned her into a, a robot. Yeah. I am Groot. Yes. Yes what? That he's Groot? He said maybe this man downloaded the passkey into the computer on his head. Huh? That could store the passkey. If we find him, we save Rocket. She gotta go back. No, now they gotta go find the High Evolutionary's place. Do you know who the High Evolutionary is? Yeah, he's some dickhead who dissected my best friend. Second best. The High Evolutionary <laughs> isn't someone you want to think about messing with. We won't with. think about it when we do it. <laughs> Somewhere inside of you. I don't give a shit about your Gamora. Life made me me. How do they soften her? Oh, she's real rough, isn't she? Adam. Yes, mother. Show him we mean business. Do you mean to melt him? I said show him we mean business! Well, let's just question the man's friend! Friend! You think that's a friend? It's an animal! <laughs> he looks sad. Yeah, he just kills, killed his owner. <laughs> I get it. Outpost, this is Gamora, are you there? Oh jeez, didn't disintegrate his walkie. Well, I need you guys to come pick me up. I'm gonna upload the location link to the craft I'm on. Just gave her free, free pass. Right to you. I love the flaming lips. What? I love the flaming lips. Life is a pond. Perhaps what you need to do, Quill, is learn to swim. That actually made sense. Yes, it made sense. Yeah. You know, lots of analogies, Quill. Analogies, metaphors, etc. For instance, <laughs> Gamora's head is like a lily pad because it is green. Analogy. Nailed it. Yesterday, I made a poop shaped like a fish. Even my butt is capable of making an analogy. <laughs> it's a talented butt. Hello. Oh, jeez. Oh, boy. Their rage is gone. We have the peaceful creatures we always sought, ready to inhabit the new world. Batch 89 was never meant for the new world, P13. You could figure out the complex workings of cytoplasmic filtration systems, but you couldn't figure out that. You told me he was perfect. Right? Prep it for surgery and removal in the morning. What about the rest of Batch 89, Sai? Incinerate them. Those are his friends. How does the rocket escape? Counter Earth. That looks just like home. Sure why should. Was, why did he make a copy of Earth. Why wouldn't you make a copy of Earth? Mm -hmm. 
It's like a replica of Earth. It makes no sense. I'm with Peter. Habitable. I, why wouldn't you? Just, That's a big fucking ship, isn't it? The fuck is that? It's a bat lady. They're gonna be so confused. Hello. We mean you no harm. Oh Jesus, Drex. Full kaiju. Get down, Everybody's Full kaiju. We just need to save our friend. Do they understand English? Gamora is here. Which means the squirrel is also. How are they going to find his assistant here? Have a translator? It's like straight out of the 80s a little bit. I am grouped. It's not rude. It's what it's here for. Drax, sit up! Idiot. <laughs> Drax, sit up! It's what it's here for. Drax, it isn't. <laughs> It's made for people to sit shoulder to shoulder right next to each other. Find it hard to believe. It doesn't have multiple purposes. I'm sorry. My <laughs> friend is a dumbass. Yeah. That's the same as your dying. <laughs> Guys, can I proceed, please, to try to save our friend? Drax, I see you. <laughs> uh, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna draw. I'm gonna draw the man that we're looking for. But just have, hmm. hurry, put a, put a picture up. Can't she just pull a picture of the man up? Have you seen this man? That's very good. Can I have that later to hang in my apartment, please? Yeah. <laughs> Is that your car in the driveway? Oh. Hell. He's like, dang it. <laughs> Don't give this stranger my car. Let me just get it out of the repair shop or something. Push the button. It looks like you're pushing the keyhole. <laughs> Press that in. Okay. Now what? Open the fucking door. <laughs> <laughs> that is a stupid design. <laughs> the instructions were very unclear. <laughs> this is stupid design. <laughs> Been a while. I don't think he's ever driven an Earth car. You want me to drive? No. I'll drive. I don't want you to drive. I got this. Oh, it's a stick, so yeah. That... What's Gamora gonna do? You must be a really loyal pet. They're willing to do all this for you. Is she drinking? Looks like it. Alf trading cards. Garbage pail kids. Oh dang, you think they would have, uh, figured this part of Earth out and made it better, huh? This is the perfect society? No, that's probably why he's so upset, huh? He's trying to make perfect, turns out. And give people free will. Yeah. That's gonna make me vomit. This one has been running for two hours without breaking a sweat. It's incredible. They can survive on 30 calories a day, and, but will she be ready for the new colony? A new one, huh? He just can't seem to get it right for himself, right? We're here to see... The high evolutionary is expecting you. Which means it is a trap. It's a face-off. She stays here. Ooh. Eve clean. Let's go. Not gonna scan Groot. Groot's got him tucked into his roots, doesn't he? I think he's scan proof. Yeah, it's like trapped behind his breastplates or something. You're gonna be an asshole about it. Mm. 
He's having a bad day. What are you doing? They ain't gonna set us free. Yes, they are, Rocket. That's what he had in the ship was his old tool. Is it gonna work on their door? Hopefully. You did it! You did it! It really is good to have fun! Uh. Sky. She saw heaven. So she said sky. Oh, that's what happened to his face. Oh, no. They missed Rocket and hit his friends. He should have shot the high evolutionary while I was at it. Yeah. They put a special little brain in this guy. Mm-hmm. Poor Rocket. Oh, jeez. Fuck, Trax. Peter just told you to stay here. Yeah, well, that's his fault. He should know by now that I never do anything that anyone ever tells me. <laughs> so hop on. And we'll ride back to the ship. Just right over there? Yeah. He's lying to you. probably gonna have to save them anyways. Earth would be a fabulous place were it not for the ignorance and bigotry. Okay. It inspired me to create counter -earth. I don't care. All of the good and none of the bad. I don't <laughs> Yeah, we saw the yeah, all of the good really and none working. of the bad out there. I'm not trying to conquer the universe. I'm perfecting it. How's it working out? I'm guessing Warpig came back here. Yep. Drop the badger. Ouch. Anything I've done, I've done for the betterment of the universe. Mm. Better universes generally don't include a bunch of octopuses selling meth to guys with cockroach heads. They do not. Which is why, as I've done many times before, gonna destroy this planet and make a new one. Mm -hmm. I got an 89P13 and I'm on my way. We're in possession of the <laughs> subject. Oh, dang. I feel like they're about to blow it's up a, this planet. It's a giant ship. The Sovereign are going to be on their side now? <laughs> what the hell? We're working for the same boss. Yes, I need the credit, chum, to save my entire civilization and back off. Youch. Oh, no. Oh, it's starting to happen now. He doesn't even have Rocket yet. Uh, your best chance is to get back on the ship and get the fuck out of there. Oh. Ouch. Oh, that's gonna piss off Warlock. Hey. I need you to bring the ship here. Now. Uh-oh. Oh, we can't do that exactly because we're not at the ship. Oops. Come on, Gamora. Get the hell out of there. What kind of ship is that? Figure it out fast. What do you have in your hat? <clears throat> Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> He's got more than just Star Lord's guns. Great teamwork. Ooh, Mantis. Huh? No, 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 no. Hold up. What, what kind of bright idea was that, Quill? Uh oh. Quite a novel escape plan. <laughs> you kill us both! Not both! <laughs> Groot's got wings. Why are we doing this? Quill and Groot are inside. We have to get them out. <laughs> you just fell back. past them. <laughs> Pull up, honey. She was supposed to be one of the better pilots. Okay, with the planet still exploding. I hope the passcode's in there. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, God, yeah. <sighs> Hurry up and get on board. It's hard to breathe. Yeah. Oh, no. We are entering space. <laughs> That worked? These tracks. Oh, God. They're like, now we gotta save all those kids. What kind of monster slaughters a civilization? <laughs> what kind of monster dis destroys uh, Thanos? Right. You're lucky I was able to knock down that door. Lachan and Gamora are probably dead because of you! It's not his fault, he's stupid. He's a liability. <laughs> he makes us laugh and he loves us. <laughs> How is that a liability? She's got a good point. <laughs> and competence. Not sure I appreciate this defense. <laughs> <laughs> he's the only one of you who doesn't hate himself. So I don't care if he's stupid. Thank you. <laughs> Forget. Ha! You're lucky I was able to knock down that door with my incredible strength. <laughs> Nebula's over it now, too. Fauna? <laughs> That language isn't in my translator. Yeah, Mantis probably has the most vast translator, too, because mm -hmm. of Ego's journeys around the world, our galaxy. If she had a translator, why didn't she help translate with that couple in the house? Because that's a whole new civilization that's never been... Another language she hadn't... Yeah, that wouldn't be in anybody's translator. Oh, he's dying. Yeah. The sky is beautiful, and it is forever. And... I've been flying with our friends. Well, I'm not gonna lose him. He's gone. I'm not letting him go. Come on, Rocket. There are the hands that made us, and then there are the hands that guide the hands. <laughs> I'm not a raccoon. It's a profound statement. The hands that control the hands, God. Oh, she softened. Where's Nebula? She's uh, because the code is on the comm behind you. <laughs> Why are you on the ship? Just say you, obviously. No, I told you to go back. You gotta know by now. Figure out an incredibly clever way to get out of a fix. <laughs> Tell them we're coming to save them. Pay attention or play with the kids. One or the other. <laughs> How did you get out? That's not really important. I am Groot. Jumping a thousand feet to your death made out of parachute is a clever way of getting out of a fix. What? You're all just making up stuff that he's saying, right? <laughs> <laughs> now they all speak Groot. Back in your cages. <laughs> How do they how do they kill this guy? They will die unless you bring me what is mine! Screw 
screw you, you stretch-faced RoboCop-looking Skeletor wannabe, purple nurple, peace hop. <laughs> <laughs> he does look like Skeletor, with RoboCop's face. The one thing even Mutak Soviets never do is call me Bad Dog. Oh my oh. God. <laughs> Can't take it back if she is a bad dog. Oh, oh it right. never stops hurting. <laughs> <laughs> I know, poor dogs. Oh gosh, where's Howdy? He's over there being a good boy. He's a good boy. The Hellspawn had it, sire. But what? 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 You blew up the planet too fast. In hundreds of years of our creations, only one has known true invention. Here's an anomaly. Uh, an anomaly, right? Mantis okay? She didn't break a stem. Antenna. That's what I said. Stem? <laughs> She's not a flower. <laughs> you need to talk to the other children, all of them here, and tell them to stay away from the freaking what the hell are you doing, Mantis? Explaining it, dickhead! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh no. Stop yelling at them. They should all be programmed with sign language, right? Hello, dumb idiots. <laughs> I had a little girl like you. You know what she used to like? She liked when I made monkey noises. How's that a monkey? <laughs> Monkeys from his planet. Robots? <laughs> That's a robot. Alika <laughs> 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 Lika Frank Eka Lolo Laki Ek Slara Biki Pulo Pulo. He can speak their language? Why didn't you tell us you knew their language this whole time? Why didn't you ask? <laughs> He's literal. You have to ask him. <laughs> Feel free to stay behind in the cargo area. I'm not leaving my sister with that jackass. This you? Fell out of your bag. Let's do this. She's starting to feel it. Mm -hmm. She's softening. Now what? Little, little ships. Ooh. They bring nowhere? They're bringing the whole nowhere. <laughs> that's not the whole planet. Yeah, that's nowhere. It's inside the head of a celestial. Space Force, one of them holds subject 89P13. Release the house board. All of Gosh, that is a disgusting thing. Spider mole. Gross. What is that? Hell spawn is what he's been calling all the. Are these the rejects with the aggression? He kept them all, or maybe he perfected a different one. Well, he could be practical. Man, he's super strong. Adam Warlock's actually one of the strongest beings in the Marvel universe. Like he uh, rivals Thanos in strength in the comic books. What's up, kiddo? You're supposed to be asleep. It's almost 10 o'clock. Okay, just take your blanket off, kiddo. Okay. Just throw your blanket off of you. Sleep on top of him. You know, I just want my blanket. Your blanket is underneath it, so just throw back that puffy blanket. I know. All right, I'll do it. I'll do it. Let's go to bed. Come on. Warlock's still back on the big part of the ship, though, right? Yes. 
Ew. Shit. Same team? You know what would save their whole existence is if they just took out this asshole that created yeah. them work with the Guardians. Open the pit. Sire, our bargaining power will be gone. Oh, no. I was gonna kill them. Mm. Oh, God. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Drax just needs to get swallowed and kill him from the inside again. He doesn't have a gun. Can Mantis touch him and calm him? Oh shit. <laughs> Close driving. He's fine. He's probably fine. We're not gonna hurt you. This is ballsy. That's what she needs to do. Comfort it with her powers. She's feeling what it's feeling. Are they a part of the team now? I think so. Come on, Corgan. This is your ch chance. Whistle. Use your heart, not your brain. Use your heart, boy. Exactly, Yondu. That was awesome. A good dog. She's a good dog. <laughs> With telekinesis. You must stop for God's sake! There is no God! That's why I stepped in! Why are you strong? No. God created a rocket through your hands. Mm -hmm. Created an anomaly. Do it, do it, do it, do it. And retreat. Oh, he didn't like that. No. Well, now there's no control. He destroyed his own thing. We go in there, we get Mantis, Nebula, and Drax. We move in, we get him, and we get him. There they are. Did that look cool? <laughs> there are thousands of creatures on the ship. Many of them are children. Then we need to be good, you two. Huh? It means friends. Oh. I'm done running. He's smarter than the creator, yeah. so. What's his name? The. The. High evolutionary. Hmm. <laughs> Mantis knows. <laughs> <laughs> Teamwalk. I think that golden guy is still alive. Peekaboo. <laughs> nice one, Groot. <laughs> oh, no. Good thing she's mostly machine. Mm. 
Ugh. That's why she's the best warrior. Is, that thing looks like a loft cat from Rebels. It does, yeah. Right? Mm-hmm. Hello, moron. <laughs> We're gonna save him too. Yeah. Um, th this way to. Uh... Thank you. Yes, you're welcome. <laughs> I was screaming at something scary behind you, not you. you <laughs> Why did they keep that thing alive? Where did the high evolutionary go? He's lurking somewhere in the shadows. Is Nebula gonna go down with the ship? Okay, Cosmo, stitch it up. It needs to be airtight for the kids to make it across. Locking up, Captain. Well, she's gonna seal it with rubble. Go, go, go. Uh oh, Cosmos is getting tired. Jump! Jump, jump, so jump. Strong. Oh, very great. Why are you so slow? <laughs> First rocket. Oh, he went after the high evolutionary. Yeah. I wanted to get more. Oh, is there still people from his batch alive? I imagine he won't want to leave anybody behind. Mm -mm. Anything. Oh, oh, it's a bunch of baby raccoons. He still got his key card. That purple guy's gonna try to kill him the same way. You think he dies? You think he dies? Well, the purple guy doesn't want to kill him, he wants to take his brain. He is a raccoon. <laughs> You're so cute. Hold on tight. Going for a ride. No! You thought you could escape me! No! You have some worth in and of yourself without me! No! His ego can't handle that his brain is more powerful than his. The name's Rocket. Rocket Raccoon. And he's got friends. She's gonna take his flesh off. It's a mask. What's it did to me? Kill him. Why? Because I'm a freaking guardian of the galaxy. We have to get out of here now. We have to save them. We've got all the kids on board. No, Pete. The rest of them. All the animal kids. It's like Noah's fucking Ark now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 shit. They gonna be able to fly out of there with all that shit? Go, baby. Go, baby. <laughs> Jeez, look out for them. I cannot hold. You are strong. Oh no. Nice. Someone gonna catch him? 
Oh, shit. Gamora's gonna save him. Oh no, oh no. Oh no. Adam. Yeah. That's funny. <laughs> oh, I hope his face recovers. <laughs> Get him in a med bay. Did that look <laughs> cool? <laughs> come on. Oh, Gamora's concerned. Do it. No, do it. I'm Groot. Thanks. Just tell them I'm gonna be right. I am Groot. Yeah. It's good working with you two. She could understand him the whole time. No, I think she can just, just now she just understand him. You okay? She'll come around. I need to go out and discover what I want. I'll come with you. No, Drax. That's the whole point. But you need someone to protect you. I don't. Not a bad way. Just because of your incredible weakness. <laughs> I love you guys. It's been working on some new <laughs> words. Finally sound like Vin Diesel, too. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, moving out of the next decade, huh? That's why he went back for it, to give it to Rocket. Because, you know, Rocket likes it more than he really? does. Florence and the Machine? That's the song we're going with? I mean, I like, I like the song, but... <laughs> Your grandpa's never going to believe where the fuck you've been. He saw him get abducted. He ran out after Peter and saw the mm -hmm. spaceship take him away. Hey. He's been waiting for him to come home. All right, just gotta wait till the, after the credits so we can talk about it. Well, all right. It went ahead and surprised me. I loved it. Yeah. Yeah. I love the Guardians of the Galaxy. That's the thing is, it, it was self contained. Yeah. yeah. I think so. that's what I just. I like that. I appreciate that they don't have to incorporate every other yeah. freaking storyline in it. So they were. I mean, there's still, you know, ripples from what happened when they went sure. back to Earth and fought Thanos and all that stuff. But in the end. This one's, yeah, the Guardians yeah. of the Galaxy is still, like, the most playful. I don't know, it's really emotional yeah. all the time. Yeah, the story was yeah. deep oh. cuts. Where's Mantis? Okay. How about your favorite oh, music? Rocket. Um, Britney Spears and Corn. Good choices. I gotta go with the man, Garth Brooks. Yeah! Oh, this one's kind of special. Mm -hmm. Taking it back to number one. Yeah. What are they doing? They're there to fight something. Nah, I can handle this by my lonesome if y'all want to chill. <laughs> Group, wake up. Oh. Talk about a kaiju, Groot. Holy cow. He's, he's been taking lots of fertilizer. Do you ever feel a little sad for them? Yeah. What does she do? What's the cat do? Just a sidekick. 
Oh, there's still one more. I don't know. I just feel like Guardians of the Galaxy has the most heart. It has, like, yeah. the most heart and the most humor, and I think that's just what makes it the best yeah, You get the love the story MCU. with Peter and Gamora. Mm-hmm. A lot of heart in this one with Rocket's whole backstory. Yeah. I, thought, I didn't think he was going to make it out of this whole life. I didn't either. Because of how much they showed us the beginning. And... I thought one of them was going to die. Yeah. I love that none of them did. <laughs> yeah. They even gained a couple members. Yeah. Like Adam Warlock. We even saw Yondu mm-hmm. for, for Flash. So, because I mean, that was probably the most emotional moment. The last movie was Yondu's Yondu. sacrifice mm-hmm. for Peter. So, yeah, this had a couple of moments of like tear jerkers. Yeah. You had a little bit of an anti cry drink, didn't you? Yeah. You did. I, I wasn't it. like getting choked up, but I, I, I had like moistened eyes, you know. <laughs> but I, I wasn't like getting choked up. I just yeah. took a drink because I was like, well, okay. I think the part that got me the most is the very end when why can't I ever remember her name? Nebula. Nebula. Told Drax that he's supposed to, he's not a you know an idiot. He's a dad, yeah. right? That's a good moment. He's not a destroyer. He's a he's, he's a, a dad. dad. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's a... He's been doing all the dad jokes the whole time. So exactly. That yeah, that's his thing. He didn't even know it. <laughs> <laughs> Who is your favorite member of the Guardians of the Galaxy? Mantis in this one, I think. Mantis? Yeah. Yeah. She's the one that kind of understands everybody the best. It's because she has... Right. Empathic powers. <laughs> It's her powers. Though. But she knew how to get to Peter. She knew she couldn't tell Peter what yeah. he needed to hear. Well, but... She really had a heart to heart with Nebula there. That really. Yeah. Everybody, we we need everybody. Stop being mean to all of us. Yeah. And then she got mean at Drax, and then Nebula saw how that hurt Drax, and she's like, oh, shit. And then she erased it, so Drax didn't feel it anymore. Yeah. She's like, okay, I better be nice to people. Mantis, so. yeah. I like that she erased it from him right away. She's yeah. like, I didn't mean that. Yeah. I'm like, he's an idiot, but I didn't mean that. <laughs> so. I didn't need to tell him that. Yeah. The only sad thing about this is it feels like they came full circle. This is, yeah, the I end the, of the Guardians of the Galaxy era. The I think. only, like, I think Gamora and Peters is left unfinished business, I feel. Especially with how Gamora was looking at him at the Honestly, end. Honestly, I think if they... Or to just let this lie and not touch it, that would be best. Yeah. Even though there's still that like unfinished business between Gamora and Quill, I think it is finished. Yeah. They had their moment. It was a great moment. It sucks that the MCU had to kill her and then bring her back with no memory of that. Yeah. But that doesn't. I mean, it's like lots of great love stories in life, right? Like. Yeah. Also, I wonder how much like did James Gunn when he was outlining his trilogy of the guardians did he know that gamora's fate from the thanos saga i I don't know i wonder if that changed what he had to do volume through for her character and their relationship so i liked how this was centered around rocket because he's my favorite yeah i like yeah yeah he is great and just how uh he's tough and loving at the same time He's got the most heart, I feel. Definitely. And this showed why. So I like seeing his backstory and seeing where he came from. And his creator, the old he was a great bad guy that you just wanted to see them. Yeah, take you out. definitely wanted him to die. And he probably died on the ship. They didn't kill him, they just left him there, right? Mm-hmm. But I guess if you don't see him die on the old comic book rule is if you don't see them dead in a frame then they probably aren't dead yeah all in all great movie yeah. i liked it where would you rank it among the guardians of the galaxy movies one two three one two three in order okay I, there's parts of two that i really loved and then there's parts of two that i didn't love yeah. like the yondu parts of two were fantastic but the ego parts of two, like yeah. i could have like they weren't the greatest i mean he was you, a bad guy i guess you didn't like Kurt Russell as a bad guy. I just don't so. like the idea that. Yeah, I don't like Kurt Russell yeah, as a bad guy. He had no love for his. For off, his. Offspring. For his. Yeah, I just can't. He was all ego. Yeah. All him. So, if I was judging it based on the ego storyline, I'd actually put it one, three, two. Okay. But the Yondu part of it. The bad of, guy plot was better in this one than. I think so. Okay. All right. 
So yeah, we got to see the origins of Peter and two. What about for you? Do you would, how would you rank them? I, I think this might be my favorite. Really? Yeah. Three, one, two, three, two, one. I love the one. rocket storyline. No, I, three, one, two. I just think one was like such. Yeah, it was a great intro to. Um, if you need help mowing a lawn, I'll do it. But I can't. Here we go, Stinger. Mowing his lawn, it just feels weird. Don't get me started. Elite abduction. Kevin Bacon shares all. <laughs> the legendary Star Lord will return. Oh. It's just a Star Lord movie. So him getting Gamora's heart back. I don't know. On his own. Hmm. I mean, that's the only unfinished business, really, is him and Gamora. So, if they do a Chris Pratt solo movie with him, probably finds out Gamora needs saving from some Ravager plot. And Could be. Goes and gets her. Hmm. Well, we'll see about that. Yeah. Like I said, I think it would be okay if this one just ended where it ended. Yeah. Cause it was a good finish. I know, but just like a love story sometimes is a sad ending, you know? Like sometimes yeah. the the loves of your life, you just, it never, the timeline never. They had their moments and then. they Their timeline was going tragedy. and then it. Yeah. Sometimes the timelines never went up. was lucky at all to get a Gamora from the past mm -hmm. to bring forward and change her just enough to betray her evil nebula and her thanos and yeah exactly Endgame, so so yeah all right well this was great yeah what should people comment on after guardians of the galaxy volume three rank them and tell us your favorite guardian yeah what was your favorite song from this soundtrack the soundtrack of course was amazing yeah it was all mostly 90s stuff yeah i didn't 2000s. love these songs as much as i loved the previous yeah, the, the 70s, 70s and, and the 80s, 80s and yeah. the 90s is what they're yeah doing. i mean i i'm a child of the 90s so yeah. um i like the acoustic creep that was a good song to start with yeah yep yeah, that was that was a good one yeah what's your favorite song in the volume three mm -hmm. anything else thanks so much for hanging out with us come back next week for a different movie yeah, different movie. And check out our Patreon link down below for early access to our videos. If you want to come here, access to pulls up, spooky watch links links down there. Check it out. Until next time, have a good one. Bye.